Hi, Tim Roberts, Application Engineer with Go Engineer. This quick tip video, I'm going to be discussing snapshots in SolidWorks. Now, the biggest misunderstanding about snapshots are people think that they save an external file, and they do not. Uh, they create an image, uh, a screen capture, if you would, that lives in the SolidWorks assembly document. Now, if I were wanting to create an external uh, image file, I would just suggest you use File Save As, uh, and under File Type, go down to either JPEG or TIFF or, or possibly PNG. All of these save out external files. Okay, snapshots live in the SOLIDWORKS document. In fact, they live right here under the Display Manager, under the View Scene Lights and Cameras area. Okay, here we have one right there. That's where you can access them. And um, let's go ahead and uh, create a screenshot. Let's say we were doing an assembly instruction and um, we wanted to capture uh, an image in this exact location. Okay, great. So under View Display, I can choose Take Snapshot, or, or I can hold down the Alt key in Spacebar. Okay, and that creates a snapshot. And now if I want to get back to that, I move my model, maybe I rotate these guys, right, and I want to see that exact state again. I can go back to snap one, okay, and I'm really looking at an image right here. To get out of it, I do edit snapshot, exit snapshot to get out. Okay, now let's talk about um, where I really see the use of this functionality being, um, and that would be... Um, with assembly instructions, uh, manuals. Let's say if I were creating a, an instruction manual for building this um, assembly, I would probably be doing an exploded view at some point. Let's just take this screw and we'll explode it out. Okay, right there. Okay, and I wanted to create a snapshot uh, of, of this exact assembly step. So I'm going to go up to view, display, I'm going to take my snapshot, okay, and I'm going to call it screw insertion. And I'll say OK to that. And now it appears over here. Okay, now the nice thing is, now if I collapse this assembly, right, sort of the undo of an explode, I can get back to that by going back to my snapshot of screw insertion. Okay, and then exit. Okay, so. Let me show you one additional thing, uh, and that's the ability to add comments. So if I right mouse click uh, the snapshot and go to comment, okay, I can say uh, use quarter 20. I can put a date time snap on here and say uh, save and close. Now that will appear as you mouse over in the tree. Um, you can see we've got our comment there on the preview. This is Tim Roberts at Go Engineer. Thanks for watching this quick tip video.